Oh, how is your day going there, V? It seems like it's been a big productive day for the skeptic camp. Hey, um, well, I'm, I'm here to answer questions of what exactly did I do wrong in that conversation. Well, I can start off with one with your, your fucking pill pull with Karen's uh, talking about how, oh, it was a personal attack. Jim called her drunk. He must know about her. Are you talking about when Karen had like 40 fucking tweets in a row at one in the morning, all caps locking, screaming her fucking head off? And I responded, are you drunk right now or on psych medication? Didn't sound like a personal attack. It kind of seemed like maybe I'm trying to puzzle out why she's flipping her shit at midnight and tweeting out 400 fucking things in a rage. Okay, well, I wasn't aware of the context, but you I were know aware of the context because we've had this conversation before, and I'm I'm pretty certain we've had it on stream before. I, I told you that Karen actually drinks, and you calling her drunk is well, uh, you know. <laughs> It's a personal attack if it was meant in a personal way. I don't know much about her, nor do I fucking care. But if you're going to spaz out on Twitter, typing out a shit ton of messages and freak the fuck out, I'm going to say, are you insane or a drunk right now? Are you high? What the fuck is your issue? Yeah, I see your point. But, you know, she basically said that uh, you're jobless or something like that. Uh, uh, she did what she did what everybody from your camp. Let's just you know be all right. She did what everybody from your camp has done for like the last year. How you guys like to put up this bullshit moral facade of we're so anti-doxing, we're the rationalists. Let's huff our fucking farts. But then you dance around doing dirty shit, and then you're like, oh, you couldn't catch me. Oh, where's the proof? Well, it's blowing up in your fucking face, isn't it? Oh, it's so convenient, right? That oh, we're we're not directly involved yet. Here are all these audio leaks that keep fucking happening. Here's Kraut involved in more gay shit. Here's Tonka involved in gay shit. Who shows up in the fucking call? You do. Who's Kraut and Tonka talking about Sargon? And I've got something special, you know, waiting for Sunday in regards to Sargon and releasing information through third party sources. So I can't wait to see his reaction to that. Well, if you have something against them, you feel free to publish it. No, but... this isn't me having something against them. It's just I'm sick and tired of the shit coming no, if out. You of... have, if you have evidence, like, go, yeah. go publish it. But Oh, no, I do. I, I do. But I'm, I'm not against you making it public. But my question is, what exactly did I do wrong? V, you can't go around saying, oh, I disassociate and I disavow and oh, what they're doing is so gay. And then give these slippery fucking answers. Well, I don't recall. I don't remember. You're not a politician. Wait, you're, in a call, you're in a conversation with these people. They're talking about doing dirty shit. They're talking about dirty shit they've done. And then you're asked directly from Josh, well, how many times did you go into a, a crowd's Discord server? And you're like, I never went in. Well, maybe I went in. Okay, I went in once. Well, maybe it was three or four times. That's like the joke about the Jewish guy saying, I can't believe you owe me $5. If I don't get my $10, I'll never <laughs> survive. If I don't see that $25 by next week, I'm going to be in the poorhouse. Where is my $50? Well, Jim, you disassociate yourself from your fans. Like nope. I remember, I love my fans. I yeah. love every one of them. I love all the retarded ones. My sweetie squad, I love them. I hold them close to my chest. I don't disavow anything. So, did you get it's Diogenes? A brand, it's a brand new day. Okay. Did you get Diogenes banned from Twitter then? Did I get Diogenes banned from Twitter? Yeah, hmm. no, that was one of my sick 24-hour ops. Here's what happened, V. I jumped into a call with Kraut and Tonka, and then I pretended that I forgot because I was drinking too heavily to remember it. Well, the point is that these conversations happened months ago. Months ago. Yeah, so, you know, this hasn't been some stop-and-go bullshit. This has been something that Kraut and others have been engaged in now for a fucking year. And it's so dumb. It always blows up in their face. And the people that keep, you know, associating with them and getting involved with them are retards. So, I mean, if you're associating and getting involved with them, even if it's this hands-off shit, you are retarded. But I told you about this. Blowing yeah. up in your face. No, see, that's another thing you and Tonka seem to like to do. You seem to like to pretend that you told people about it, but you do it in vagaries. You'd be like, oh, well, I, maybe I had a conversation. Well, this seems like a bit of a different conversation than what Tonka and you were pretending it was, where they're talking about lying and gay ops and doing other dirty, underhanded shit. Yeah, but how I actually it, don't do it anything. Skeptics, how is it skeptics and rationalists and liberalists can go around with their dicks out talking about principled positions, and then you're just as fucking dirty as everybody else? It's not about whether doxing is right or wrong. It's about you fucks pretending that you have a moral high ground or an upright stance about it. You do the same shit everybody else does. You just want to pretend you're clean when you do it. 
But if we do so much shit, why can't you just pinpoint to something that I particularly did? The only well, thing you we, have... We've got, we've got one to pinpoint you to. You've already been involved with this shit. I'll be talking about uh, about it on Sunday Funday. Andy talked about it. Ralph's going to talk about it. Yeah. And and remember when they said, like, you want to know about the gay op? And I said, like, I'm not interested. I don't want to hear it. Like, how, how exactly was I into this gay shit? The only reason I was there... Yeah, because... you, are the, you are the PR manager. You are the facade. You are the face for Sargon. You're like his little, I mean, that's a joke. You're the little gypsy carrier pigeon. You're sent out to carry his messages. You're like one degree of separation. You know how Sargon likes to run around and say, you know, I have one degree of separation from Trump. That's kind of like you're the buffer for people to say that about him. So when Kraut, you know, talks about conversations with Sargon, I wouldn't doubt for a second they're routed through you. I mean, why are El Rachi and Tonka putting up DM conversations with you, showing even more previous conversations, talking with Kraut? But I never disagreed that I talk with Crow. I never said that I don't. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, this is the same old song and dance. I'm just tired of listening to it. I'm tired of the skeptics. I'm tired of the MRAs. I'm tired of everybody from your camp seemingly involved in the same shit and thinking you can get away with it. I'm tired of you guys not liking being poked fun at. You know, I, I joke that uh, the alpha skeptics are shoe on head and armored skeptic. They fucking are. Do you know why they're the alpha skeptics? It's not just because they're better than everybody else and they get more views and they have more fucking subs. It's because they don't get involved in this dumb shit. Shu and uh, Armored may do dumb stuff, but it's their own dumb stuff. They're not running around in discords, doing gay ops, looking for revenge on people that make fun of them on YouTube and Twitter. You know what, Jim? Every time I defend you in my camp, I get shit for that. Stop doing it. I don't want your defense. I don't want your defense, and I don't, you don't do it. I, I don't need it. I can defend myself. Don't defend me anymore, V. It's not about what you need. It's about the type of person I am. Like you, you keep saying that I run PR for Sargon and stuff like that. Like you saw you, that you I run. You do every every yeah, single yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Every I, single I the v, every single time somebody makes fun of that dumb fucker, you are right on it. I tweeted out making fun of his stupid suggestion to millennial woes, and what do you know? Within thirty fucking minutes, you and Sargon are doing a stream talking about exactly that. Yeah, I don't deny that. And you know what? I also did PR for JF on that stream. You know, where, where it was a private uh, thing. Oh, J J F the half, JF the half Jew? Yeah, I'm sure that's, is that the next vector of attack? I mean, what was it Tonka said? You got to make the audience embarrassed of the person. So let's make uh, Andy's audience embarrassed. He's a pedophile. Uh, let's make JF's audience, the old right and, you know, white nationalist, embarrassed he's a Jew. Did is I went public really with that? Did, did I went public with that? Or was it something that uh, Tonka gave me? That was something you were talking about. You said I've heard, I've heard this. I think J maybe JF's a Jew. I heard JF might. Right, be and I, did I did I give any evidence? Like, what were they going to say? It's like, oh yeah, I heard it from V. How would they prove that? I I don't know. Why were you getting together with Crowd, giving them uh, you know suggestions on how to? Oh boy, you can really roast Jim by going on this uh, tangent. You know what's really interesting too is I'm noticing a lot of concentrated shit coming from your camp that I'm seeing pop up on other places. So, yeah, I, I, I think I'm going to do a skeptic series. I, I think you guys deserve to have your asses nailed to a fucking cross. And I think I'm going to enjoy doing it because I think the Internet in general is just fucking tired of you people. And I think you got away with it for a long time just because it was a stupid blue haired, you know, feminist and the SJWs. But I think that grace period's over and you, you guys act like cunts. And I think people are just fucking tired of it. Well, you keep saying that you want to fuck with the liberals. That was literally the thing you said. And now it's like, why do liberals don't like me? Why, why are the people just going after me? And you know Be, what? Because you, disingenuous, because you disingenuous little cunts. No, no, there is no evidence. It's the exact shit yeah. you always do. If Sargon can't control it, he tries to kill it. Oh, here's IBS doing well. Here comes Sargon and his dumb fuck brigade of capos to try to shit it up. Oh, look, there's fat fuck quarter pounder. Look, IBS gets people killed. Oh, hey, look, here comes Jeff Holiday with his dildo collection. IBS is responsible for school shootings. It's the same fucking shit every time. He does it to memes, it. too. He does it to memes, too. He'll I did none of it. And then drive them into the dirt. You fucks are doing it with the NPC thing now. I'm sure that'll get fucking butchered just like Keck did. It's really interesting that you guys talk all this shit about the alt-right and the white nationalists, but you go on poll and you'll steal their shit and use it and monetize it. So are you just disingenuous whores? Like, what's the deal there, V? Well, the deal is you have went on several streams disassociating, uh, disassociating yourself from your audience and saying you're not responsible for what your audience does. But then you're going to come to me and say I'm responsible for what Carapan does. I'm responsible for what you know other people do. 
And if you stopped, if you stopped acting like a fluffer and sucking the dick of these people and being their PR manager, maybe people would, you know, take your word that you're disassociated you from them. That I kind of but you, like, but you no. literally, you literally get led around on a leash. They treat you like shit. I've listened to the streams you've done with them. You get treated like a bitch, and you still fluff them. And it's just pathetic. Stop. Have well, a fucking. Well, if you would have noticed, I kind of stopped. Like when I went on the heel stream, and they wanted to talk about Sargon and shit, I said I'm not interested. I don't want to talk about that. I've been on other streams, and I said I'm not interested. You look at my main channel. I haven't done any drama. This channel, I only talked about the news. Like for for oh, a month oh, well, now, let me, let me I have stuff. One one second. I see your chat. Uh, hey hey, skeptic fans, suck my dick. I'm gonna burn it to the ground, and you can't fucking stop me. Cry about it, you little faggots. Oh, a reckoning is coming. You can't do a fucking thing about it. Welcome to the age of the sweetie squad. Well, you let me ask you, Jim. Cops. What is your opinion on my theory regarding well, what, Sargon what was, personally what, being involved with uh, Kraut and paying money for somebody to try to dox you? I, I don't know. It, it's just, isn't it really convenient? I mean, isn't it really interesting and coincidental, Josh, that it's the same fucking group of people that constantly comes from? I mean, this is, you know, they. I think they think they're dealing with toddlers. Where they can throw out the, well, do you have evidence? Do you have a videotape of me uh, personally doing this? Well, I mean, grow the fuck up. First if, of if all, you're it's not keep the same. Acting okay. like this. If Karen you're Strong, keep Karen Strong like is this. not a skeptic, Jim. Like Karen oh, Strong is no, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, she just goes to speaking engagements with Sargon. He just, you know, promotes her videos. The same talking points are coming from her. Yeah, yeah, wink, wink. Oh, okay, oh, so oh, here, here's, Dr. Random, gonna... here's Dr. Random or Cam at his fucking This Week in Stupid thing. They totally don't know each other. Fuck off. Oh, oh so fuck anyone off. that Sargon is the same group now? Oh, well, if you're doing business with them, you know, if you're, if you're making money with them, I'm going to say there's an association. Right? And Did they, they just wander into the building, V? Did he say you pick somebody off the street and say, hey, retard with the puppet, sing me a song? So wouldn't that mean that you have an association with Tonkasa? Because you went on the kill stream. You made it famous. Oh, okay. Yeah. You, you want to do that? Sure. I'll trade you tip for Tad. I don't give a shit. See, this is the difference between yeah, us. Yeah, but that's the thing. What, what, no, no, no. Like, v, v, here is okay. the difference between us and why I am better than you. Ready for it? I don't mind if I end up in the sewer covered in shit. As long as I can drag your dumb fucking ass down there with me. See, you faggots want to be pristine and clean and look good at the end of it. That's what you're more interested in is your image and your ego. I don't really give a shit about that. So if I got to roll in the shit to make sure you stink with me, I'm going to do it. Fuck you guys. I'm, I'm, fucking, I'm, I'm fucking done with you. You're, I hate your group. I hate the shit that you do. You're fucking all obnoxious. And uh, I'm going to enjoy mocking the shit out of you. And you could tell that fucking uh, waiter from Applebee's, he can suck my cock and I'll see him on Sunday fun day. Uh, that's it. I'm out. I've had a fun time. Enjoy your D&D, uh, V. Uh, Josh, enjoy your conversation. Well, very, uh, yeah, very funny. Jim. You know why you said the uh, people can't debate, uh, can't win a debate against you? Why is and, that? Why is that? Yeah, I'll tell you why. Because every time someone has you on a point, you're going to go with "I don't care." Oh, oh yeah, Jim's such the nihilist. Let's be big boy no, adults that, that, and have that's, in that's the reason why, why there's here's no the point debate. in talking here's with the, you. Here's the debate, V. I think you guys are faggots. Oh, okay, okay, great. What's your what, what? You want to debate that fact? Hey, Jim, your opinion is wrong. Fuck off. All right, I'll see you guys.